So our next project is going to be dealing with one-point perspective. That is a drawing method which helps make shapes appear to be 3D. Also shows how things appear to be getting smaller as they get further away. So we're going to use this practice worksheet and I'm going to show you how to make these shapes appear to be 3D just with some simple lines. First, we'll start with the square up here in the upper left corner. So what I'm going to do is line up my ruler on the corner of the shape and I'm going to have it going directly to this dot here. This is our one point, our vanishing point. This is where all of our lines are going to be drawn. So we take a ruler, line it up, and once it's lined up, you just draw your line. I'm going to do that for each corner. And this last one back here, I'm not going to do because I don't want my line going through my shape like this. Okay, don't want that. So there, that's all we have to do for the first one, the square. That one's done. The next shape we'll look at is the circle. A lot of people ask, how do we do that if there's no corners? So what I do is I start with my pencil on the vanishing point. I bring my ruler over and butt it right up against it. And then I take it over as far as I can go on the side of the circle, and then I draw my line. I'll do the same thing for the other side. So this is only going to have two lines. Okay, so that one's done. I try and tell students to uh, imagine it as being the bat signal. That's the, uh, the Batman symbol that they flash in the sky when they need help. Okay. All right, so the next shape we're gonna do is the triangle here in the bottom left-hand corner. So I'm gonna start down here at this one, line it up, going to the vanishing point, Again, all your lines are going to get drawn to that vanishing point. Now, if I come over here to this one, that's going to cut through my shape, so I'm going to skip it, go to the top, and the triangle's done. Now, the last one is a star. So, this one is a little trickier. It can be a little more confusing. Same concept, so I'll start with the points. Again, going to the vanishing point. Now, can this one go? Okay, it looks like it can. It's not going to cut through my shape until I get to the top of the star. So once I hit that top of the star, I'm just going to stop there. This one... That's going to cut through my shape, so I don't have to do that. So it looks like my star is done. Okay, give that a try, and then we will jump into our official project.